The heptode, or pentagrid converter, features seven active elements inside. It's easiest to think of it as two pentodes that share a plate, cathode, and suppressor grid. Just like in a normal pentode, the suppressor grid is tied to ground, and the two screen grids are tied together and pulled high through a relatively small resistor. This just leaves two different control grids. If just one of the two control grids is given a positive charge, while the other still has a negative charge, no electrons can flow from the cathode to the plate. Both control grids must be given a positive charge to enable electrons to flow. This makes the heptode great for signal mixing. Here we'll be using a 6BE6 heptode set up as shown. Two different signals will be input onto the control grids, one a sine wave and one a square wave. We can see the different input waveforms on the oscilloscope here. However, when we hook up to the output at the plate, we can see a hilarious looking waveform that is a mix of the two input signals. 